Okay, this is the third and final game of the third and final round of dreams of our Dreamscape uh, custom set draft. Uh, it's is me and Vero playing my custom set Dreamscape, and uh, we just had two, ver yeah, two very close games, one each, uh, and we're going into the third and final game. Just doing a little bit, just did a little bit of sideboarding, uh, bringing in this card, and uh, we will be off. So. Well, game one was not exactly close. Uh, no, actually, two. actually, game game one wasn't close. Game two, yeah, um, was closer. Okay. Uh, okay, so let's go. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna go on the play, draw my card, so draw my hand. Obviously, this the scary thing is is I've only drawn fairly subpar hands of them, and hmm. this is pretty decent. Although uh, I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna game. keep. I'm gonna keep this. I am keeping as well. Um, okay, so we're going to go with, hmm, actually, this is like slightly interesting on like how I play this out. Uh, I'll play uh, just a swamp and an end. Uh, I'm very happy to see this. Okay, forest. No turn one creature, thank god. <laughs> so my opponent is playing, uh, if you didn't watch the previous videos, playing a green-white token deck with, with travel preparations, which is going to be run me over if I give him the chance. So um, I'm going to come out the gates with uh, Premonition of Prophetic Tutor. So it's Premonition... This is an interesting card. So... But oh, five turns is so slow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> not, not exactly zipping out the gate here, but uh, we'll see what we can do about that uh, in the turn. Draw cards. I'm out of the gates with a forest into very nice. Sunbloom card. elf. So this is uh, one in the green. For, oh, I'll put up images. Uh, one in the green for a one free the elf. That's. When it becomes tapped, add green to your mana pool at the beginning of your next main phase. That's gonna be very nasty. So, I'm very much hoping that I can squeeze this. And this loses a counter. Because in any situation where I can s get through with this, I start making mana. Hmm. Being ahead on mana is obviously good. So, I'm gonna go Slumbering Vault. Uh, which mills me for one and makes my prophetic tutor one quicker. I plant super slow here, so I'm happy to see. <laughs> and uh, then I'm going to tap two and play Shambling Ghoul, which unfortunately enters the battlefield tapped. <laughs> yeah. Uh, we're going to end the turn. These are all things I'm happy to see. Because now you play a white. Absolutely and... <laughs> not. Absolutely none of the defenders like that. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, so I take one. Yeah. And then you get an extra mana. And I'm going to curve into this Jamara's descent. Yep, so uh, I showed this off before. This is the 3-2 uh, that puts a plus one plus one count on a creature, and you can pay five and a green uh, to give all creatures a plus one plus one counter. Another plus one plus one counter. And, and uh, where where are you putting the counter? See, this card is like good enough that I pretty much forgot you do that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, so you put it on the sun blue mouth. Yep. Yeah. Nah, that's pretty good. Okay. Untap. Remove. And we're gonna go Is that with two already. Yeah, because I milled one to make it faster. Oh right. So with the uh, oh from 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 your, from your land, okay. Yep. Yeah. Uh, and so so there's two cards on top of it at the moment. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so two more turns and then I'll get it for free. Which gonna go swamp. Tap four, and play dementia shrieker. Mill milling myself for two. Okay. And so then I get to play a uh, prophetic tutor for three. Instantly. So I'm That's gonna. Not bad at all. Yeah. Not quite as slow as. Um, now the question is what do I get? Um, 
I imagine it's your friend Arthur. That's usually uh, the best choice. I imagine you're probably correct. So um, since I already see it, I can think about what it's going to do. And what it's going to do is it's going to not really do no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, okay. That's, uh... That's nasty. Anyway, I'm gonna end the turn. So here we here we find the defining. So this, this is I assume that, where that you really just. Be the defining. I, I assume this is where you go like double uh, this travel is where preps. I go double travel preps. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so counters on everything. Everything's huge. Yeah, this is a little absurd. So you can. At least trade with one of them. So I could double block the disciple. Yep. Is that what I want? I mean, that doesn't seem too bad. It's actually pretty good. Yeah, I'll do that. Okay. Because you can only kill one of them. Oh, this is true. So this is me not thinking very much. <laughs> Uh, so I'm going to take four, and which would you like to kill? I'm assuming the flyer. Yeah, I'll kill the flyer. So that, I, I shouldn't have done that. Gosh. Yes. <laughs> I wasn't uh, looking at the board that much. <laughs> yes, they both got three toughness. Oh, that's okay. Uh, passing the turn. Yeah. I'm going to draw. I'm going to go... Um... So forest, go in with Yemma, get out to two wolf, uh, Zola, two two, oop, two two, legendary wolf. I need to make a Zola token. <laughs> um, I haven't actually messed around with making token custom tokens much. Uh, and now actually like a reasonable question of what I want to Cause I can't fight your thing. So I think I just plus one and on the on Zola to give it another counter. Okay. Set uh, increase power and toughness add counter. And, and Indestruct follows just that turn, right? Yeah, yeah, it's not... Okay, your turn. Uh, draw a card. So, I made a mistake and... Yeah, it's kind of costing you. Kind of a dumb mistake. But, my hand's still pretty... I'm gonna fight... Predator, predator's Thrill. Ah, that's, uh... Instant to an agree, and target creature in control gets plus one, plus one, and fights. Ooh, yeah. brutal. Okay. And I will swing it. Throw the edict. <laughs> uh, oh. That's pretty nasty. Um. Uh... So yeah, Yammer when you're behind is not as good, because <laughs> uh, her fight yeah. just doesn't do enough. Oh, yeah. this is supposed to be exiled. So... Do I let her die, or do I kill the Shambling Ghoul? I'll just... The Shambling Ghoul's doing so little, I'll kill the Shambling Ghoul. Okay. Um, me too, I'll follow up with a rhino, because I get it. Okay, free, free for free. You got it. Three threes. Not bad so far in this format. Yeah. Even though it's slightly costed more than other formats for it. No. What? Free free? Oh, as in because it's one green green? Yeah. Uh, that's just more because, uh, yeah, so they can't be splashed as easily. Um, makes you be a bit more mono green. So we're gonna go 
tap. I have to be a little bit worried. Tap for Dementia Shrieker. So I'm going to mill two. That is not a hard removal spell. No. Ah, damn it! <laughs> My sideboard card. Uh, I brought in Reality Pool, destroy target creature with flying or dreamwalk. Um, I'm you going. Have a lot here, actually. Yeah, well, you usually have a lot of flying. Uh, I'm gonna play Dust Terror, uh -huh. and then I'm gonna use her minus two on Dementia Shrieker to kill your Rhino with the Dementia. Yeah. So give it a plus one plus one counter and fight the Rhino. Okay. Add counter, and she goes to two. In turn. The Sunbloom Elf is huge! Wait, it's not a five. It doesn't have the plus one plus one. It anymore. was last turn. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um. So I can keep pushing here. But I need to deal with this Yemma before I get um. way too much power. Mm. How much do I gain by killing, by n most likely killing whatever the next thing you play is, compared to the Dust Terror? So if you don't play a creature this turn, I'm like basically abyssing myself, and I'm really sad. Hmm. Um. Um. Okay, we're gonna add. Uh, Yama can die. Okay. I'm pretty happy to see that, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> my follow up is. A uh, small creature? Yeah, oh, creature. okay, so this is a rare. Uh, has trance, that at the beginning of your end step, return target creature card from return target card from your graveyard to your hand if its converted mana cost is equal or less than the number of tapped creatures you control. Do you have any one cost it's cards? A, not right now. Okay. But I'm just gonna throw my hand out on board. Sure. Anyway, your thing's still 5 4. That's nasty. Yeah. What am I drawing? Okay. And as soon as you give me any leeway, I'm gonna start taking over. <laughs> hmm. You, do you have another trouble ropes? No, good. <laughs> as in, not in your graveyard. You probably have one in your deck. Uh... I'm beating myself over the bad triggers in here, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This, this game would be a lot easier. Like, Soulgrass Priestess. That's a uh, decent card, but slightly yeah. slow right now. It's been a little underwhelming, uh, honestly. So now we're in top deck mode. Yes. <laughs> I have a walker of regrowth. Yes, this makes your the top deck mode is, quite a bit better. question is when it turns on. So, because if you can get or Predator's Thrill back, I pretty much lose. Well now I'm gonna push with Elf. Yeah, so I would need to triple block to kill that. <laughs> yeah. uh, I think it's better for me to just uh, take four. Yep, and I'm okay with the situation. Okay. You don't have There's anything you definitely can... I will still lose potential here. Yeah. If I if I pick up the right card, oh man, all your cards are so freaking fat <laughs> that this this is really orcs. Um hmm. So much for I should have decided to pull this card out. Uh, I'm gonna end the turn here. 
We're in sort of a half stalemate situation. Yeah, you said yeah. you can like push through damage still, so <laughs> I, yeah. I'm the one on the back foot. Oh. Yeah, so gonna, no blocks. Okay. Uh, the question is, do I do anything else? Please don't. Just draw lands. It's fine. <laughs> I'll just play with plans and pass a turn. Okay. And then of course if you use the plus five plus five and shampoo, I'm really dead. Uh nope, that's another land. Um I will end. I didn't really encounter all that much green marks despite it being all over the set. Oh sorry, say that again? I missed that. I didn't encounter a lot of Dreamwalk despite it being all over the step. <laughs> uh, I definitely did in the previous games, but uh, yeah, no, mm -hmm. it's, I'm surprised you're not playing some of the green Dreamwalk cards. Uh, so they tend to be pretty good and they're kind of aggressive. Okay, so what are you doing? So the question is how much do I really value this walk? Because I'm holding on to the dream right now, but the dream is not really showing it. <laughs> well, I, I've got so the dream of eight I, lands, and you know, that's. that's... So, so I'm actually going to threaten you. Okay. Uh, so I think here, like, I have to double block the walker, right? Yeah. yeah. And take four. And I will, in fact, show you which player. Yep, so you kill that, Walker dies, Soulgrass Priestess gets two counters. I'm down to four. Uh, wait, no, into... wait, four? Is that right? Oh, f three. I'm down to three. Uh, three. And main two, I'm gonna. Even Harrier, sure. Play some hot players. Mm, you get a two two for two. Yep. So now I'm threatening lethal. In plenty of different ways, yes. <laughs> um, I'm going to... Ugh. You do have a card that can get you out of this. Like, like board wife, yeah. <laughs> Um, well, it would be strong, but it wouldn't it completely would be strong. dig you out of this. It wouldn't completely dig you out of this. But I'm going to start strong. combat, attack you both. Okay. Okay. So, I don't think there's an awful lot I need to respect here. So I'm just going to let it through. Bye. Okay, so you take it. Um, I'm going to tap four. I oh, sorry, main two. I'm going to tap four. Yeah. And play Fetid Awakening. So he does actually have a card, but it's not yet. So enough. I kill. Yeah, and I get two more cannons on. Uh, yeah. Is this a five-five now? That seems decent. I figured uh, that was what was going on. Tap three, I play Harmonic Dreamer. Okay. And I end the turn. I haven't so actually got that was That's yeah. a pretty good swing turn. Yeah. But... Am I still dead? <laughs> like you have anything and I'm still dead though. Um... Okay, I'm blocking the Sunbloom Elf here. Okay. Uh, am I taking one? So I'm taking one? Yeah, just one. Okay. Oh wow, I'm still alive! What do you got? Yep. Um, I know you've, not you've, really much. you've got all the mana in the world. Oh, Clover Crawler. 
Sure. Oh, and uh, Soul Grasp Priestess gets another counter. Yeah. It's getting scary. Uh, I have to be rather worried if that's pretty soon. Ah! Uh, <laughs> oh God. Here also, you go. Really another really land. Uh, can I? So I. I don't die if you have nothing next turn. <laughs> this is true. Okay. So it's actually kind of tense right now, but I have no. But but I want two life. You're on fifteen. Eh. Okay. Yeah. Oh, and I also have top deck, so I'm gonna swing. <laughs> okay, and I'm gonna get. Go... my plus five plus five. Careful. <laughs> okay. So show it. Yeah, I show it. Oh, ah, yeah, right. Okay. I lose. GG. That was. Yeah, I, I drew a lot of lands there. <laughs> I was like, come on. Yeah. Nope, that doesn't do anything for me. Yeah, there we go. Board wipe. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, you do have one. Yeah, I, I, I have two. <laughs> yeah, no, I wasn't getting anything. Uh, so, anyway. that was with me making a pretty big mistake. Yes. Anyway. Um, I would consider looking for something else in the travel prep spot. Not yes. necessarily because it's too powerful, but at least because it's among one of the most powerful things in your set, and you don't want to have a custom set where your most iconic deck is travel prep deck. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I'm agreeing with that. Uh, and the Plotsam Plotsam kind of theme has plenty of support, so... Um, yeah. yeah, anyway, uh, that's definitely uh, something I'm going to change in the next iteration. That's okay. Thank you for the games. I do have to rush off a bit quick, real quick. Uh, I'll have okay. those videos uh, off soon. Um, everyone, if you uh, want to find details about the set or join the Custom Magic Discord channel, links to those will be in the description of the video. Uh, thank you very much. I hope you've enjoyed it. Thank you, Ruben. I'll see you guys next time.